Hi, this is Marty from Blue Lightning TV. This is part two of creating this fun, colorful party invitation poster. Picking up from where we left off, scroll down to the beer bottle and click on the eyeball to make it visible. Click off the chain link symbol. This allows us to move or resize the layer or its layer mask independently of the other. Click on the thumbnail of the beer bottle to make it active. Press Ctrl T on a PC or Command T on a Mac to open the transform tool. Go to the top left corner of the transform and when you see a curved double arrow rotate it clockwise to about this angle. To reposition it click inside the transform and move it. We want to position the bottle so the top of it touches the top of the frame and the left edge of the bottle touches the right edge of the hot dog. Once it's in position, press enter or return. Next, we'll add a red circular label on the beer bottle. Open your elliptical marquee tool, go to the bottle, and press and hold Shift and Alt on a PC or Shift and Option on a Mac and drag out a circle. To reposition it, press and hold Control or Command and move it. Make a new layer, go to the red color, and press I to open your eyedropper tool. Click down to pick up its color. Press Alt or Option plus Delete to fill it with the foreground color. To delete the selection, press Control or Command D. Let's make a large yellow circular shape on the upper right corner. To clear the area, temporarily close the text panels. Open your elliptical marquee tool again, go to the corner of the blue background and drag out a circle. Make a new layer, go to the yellow shape and open your eyedropper tool. Click down to pick up its color and fill the selection with it then delete the selection. To crop the yellow shape to the inside of the frame, go to the layer mask and press and hold Alt or Option as you drag a copy of it next to the yellow shape. We're ready to set the rest of the text. Make the top layer active. Our text will be placed above it in the Layers panel. Let's begin with the date of the event. Open your horizontal type tool and click on the black frame. Reduce the point size to about 60 and click on the foreground color. Type in 0 for hue, 0 for saturation, and 15 percent for brightness. Then click OK. Type out your text. Adjust the tracking if you'd like. To reposition it, open your move tool and move it. Open your type tool again you can also press the letter T on your keyboard. Click on your document. This time I'll make the point size 18, left alignment, click on the color box, and pick white. Type out your text. Click on your move tool to reposition it. Open your type tool and continue to type out lines of text and then position them to locations you like. I'd like to angle this line of text, so I'll open my transform tool, go to a corner, and when I see the curved double arrow, I'll rotate it clockwise to an angle that aligns itself with the bottle. When it's aligned and positioned, press enter or return. Type out as much information as you want. Adjust their angles and sizes to complement your design. Have fun creating a colorful, modernist style party invitation. This is Marty from Blue Lightning TV. Thanks for watching.